Hello Divas! I've asked all of you whether you want to see an Elf Top 10 or a Naked 3 tutorial and you asked that you want to see this first, so here we go! Hey everyone, it's Wang, Diva Makeup Queen. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am mm, super, super duper excited because this video is literally the most requested of all time, which is that you guys know that I'm an Elf girl. I started my very first video with doing an Elf haul. Okay, from like three or four years ago and so I have done so many elf hauls in fact if you're interested you can check out my elf haul playlist which I'll list down below and also right here tried out basically all the products yeah I think so yeah I think all of their products pretty much with maybe a few exceptions so for me to come up with top 10 is difficult because there's just so many different kinds of products and like how to evaluate. So this is my evaluation. This is how I know these are the best and my favorite. Because number one, I've used it for years. Number two, I reach for them almost on an everyday basis. Number three, they're comparable or better or it stands on its own. So that's how I came up with these 10. It was really hard. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, the very first thing I want to tell you is, this is the bomb.com, man. Makeup remover cleansing cloths. You thought that I was gonna tell you all about the makeup part. I will too. There's some makeup, but there's some products that I think is so exceptional for its price, it's, it's like amazing. I use makeup wipes almost every day, especially when I'm traveling on the road. I really can't do with bringing big ass soap. You know what I'm saying? Girl, I ain't got time for that, nor room in my suitcase. This is amazing, only three bucks, and it really cleanses your face really well, and then you rinse off, and then if your skin feels really smooth and nice. So I really recommend this and I also use this almost every day when I make videos for you guys, when I do swatches and when I'm doing one swatch, two swatch on my lips or face or on my hand, I use this to wipe down all my swatches so to prepare for my next set of swatches. These work great. It basically wipes off all the swatches very quickly and easily. Highly recommend. Highly. I've been using this for years now. This also I literally use every single day in all my tutorials every day when I apply makeup which is this elf one dollar brush now this guy over here this is the professional eyeshadow brush is um, really just awesome because it just fits on my lid perfectly it like it picks up any shadows just the right amount I feel like you know there's some like even like Urban Decay brushes I feel like they're not that great because it doesn't pick up the product. This picks up the product, places it, and blends really well. It plays, like for me, for my eyes, it's absolutely perfect because I have small eyes and this just fits right in right here. So this is amazing. I really recommend this. Let's talk about makeup, shall we? Oh yeah, this is my most favorite of all time, all time plus one. This is Peachy Kin, not Peachy Kin, this is Peachy Keen, you all, from the Elf Studio line Blush. This is a closed dupe to orgasm, you can build up the color, I'm wearing it today. It has that um, highlighting quality to it, looks great, especially I feel like on my skin tone or Asian skin tone. Um, really, really beautiful highlighting and blush at the same time, very close to orgasm. I love it so much. Mmm. Peachy Keen. Number four. I don't talk about this enough. Um, this is one of its best from e.l.f. Which is their booster from the mineral line. Um, I have the sheer one right here. This makes your pores completely go away. Oh my gosh. Like, after you apply this, it makes your skin so smooth, so flawless. Your complexion is completely like no pores really it's I have rarely seen a product like this and this is sort of a dupe to bare essence is it called bare mineral has a product like that and hey this one the size is bigger and it just gives you flawless skin I don't know what else to say about it it's just amazing 
Now, I must be honest with you, e.l.f. is not the greatest when it comes to eyeshadows. Not like Wet n Wild, Urban Decay, that kind of quality. Uh, I'm sorry. So, But I can always work with it, but they recently came out with this e.l.f. Prism eyeshadow. Now, these are exceptional, I think. Really, really creamy. It's almost like cream, except that it's not. Um, and it blends right into your eyes. I joke you not. These are beautiful. I actually want to get my hand on the neutral one, uh, which of course it was sold out in the e.l.f. store, but I'm going to try to get it at some point because I think these are really exceptional and this is one of the products where I think it stands on its own. You will see what I mean. Look. See that? It's just very, very beautiful colors. And I'll swatch this green for you. Look at that green. Is that not amazing? So this is an exceptional product. I really do think so. Um, beautiful. And this swatched beautifully too. Boom. Another product that has basically been through the test of time the past few years and I continue to use yeah, almost every day is the eyelash, eyelash curler which um, happens to fit right into my Asian socket perfectly um, and if I lose it, guess what? I just get a new one. A dollar. What can you lose? It's pretty amazing. I love this. Um, everybody should try this. It does the job with a dollar. Flirty and Fabulous. This is their moisturizing lipstick. Oh, this is nice. This is one of their newer products and um, it's just, it's not really moisturizing though, um, like not like the butter kind of moisturizing, but when you put it on your lips, it feels really nice and it stays on for very long and it doesn't really feather out too much. You know there's some lipsticks when you put them on, you're like, yeah, I got lipstick and I can feel it. This one feels very natural and easy on your lips, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, I really recommend this three dollars from elf studio line i know that a lot of people like their one dollar liquid eyeliner i like that one too but i like this one even better personally their precision liquid eyeliner i like the packaging a little bit better um and i love the tip i think it's probably a very similar product and boy this one is opaque really really black do you see how black that is and it lasts all day because of its tiny brush, you can have a lot of precision, which is why I like it, and a lot of control. Very nice, Elf, and of course, it dries very quickly. I hate liquid eyeliners where you sit there for like two hours and it's not dried, and then before you know it, you blink your eyes like, oh my god, it transferred. It's like, no! <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, another gray product that doesn't get enough love is their mascara primer, guys. Oh gosh, so you apply this before you apply your mascara. I feel like it's so much easier to apply my mascara with this, less clumping, number one. Number two, I feel like it makes my lashes even longer after I apply this than apply mascara. It's like my lashes like shoo! And you know, I ain't got much lashes going on, so this is a must-have for a little Asian chick like me. Last but not least, they have released their baked blush, all their baked products. And they're kind of comparable to the MAC ones, I was told anyway, I don't know, I don't have that much MAC. This is called Pinktastic. It is Pinktastic and I have it on today as a highlight, you see that? Beautiful, it works just as good. good. That beautiful highlight. Right there, boom. So, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe right here, Diva Makeup Queen. And of course, hang out with me on all my social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr, and my blog. Check it out. And I'm very curious to see what your favorite top 10 L products are. And also, I would love to get some of your um, feedback and um, suggestions for my next videos because I love hearing from you guys. So comment down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Mm.